If I die young, bury me in satin, lay me down on a bed of roses, sing me in the river. Well, I am Neil, I'm the baby in the group, and I guess the troublemaker. Always, I'm Kimberly, I'm the lead singer and the oldest of these three. And the bossy sister. And I'm Reed, I am the uh, middle child, bass player, and peacekeeper of the band Perry. Except for when he's not, That's we are <laughs> the band Perry. Well, you know, Pioneer is about discovery. It is about our journey from point A to point B. Um, coming off of the heels of If I Die Young, um, we had more questions than answers, frankly. It was like, where are we going? What are we going to say musically next? And I think part of a journey is always about discovery. We discovered a lot about even each other that I didn't even know I could learn more about Reed and learn more about Neil. But I think as we got into the creative process, um, our creative strengths kind of varied from each other and all came to the surface. Better Dig 2 is one of my favorites. It was our first single from the new record. I think what we love about it is that it has the vulnerability um, that, that folks have come to know mm -hmm. from the band Perry, but it's got the most amount of teeth of yeah. anything that we have put out yet. Yep. The lyrics are vulnerable, but the music is just, you know, kind of very aggressive. And that's one of the things I love about that being the first single of our new album. Uh, we like to keep people guessing. I think coming out with Better Dig 2, it was kind of like a what moment what uh, for a lot of people. Yeah. And so that's, it's a really great song fun life Ultimately, on stage, you're a storyteller. Absolutely. You know, um, every track on our new record, we have felt, we have lived it out, and so we really want to kind of bring each of those stories to stage. We wanted to write songs that meant something to people, and that was also one of the struggles. You know, making sure that our songs were true to us and true to them. And well. we thought we had learned something making the first album, something we could kind of carry yeah. over for Pioneer, but that really wasn't the case because we were home for a lot of the writing and recording mm -hmm. process for the first album. And then for Pioneer, we were on the road, so um, we said we had to make life happen on the run, which is true, you know, uh, because being on the road, you don't experience a lot of the things that you do whenever you're living normal life back home. You have to find different inspiration. The way you lie, it ain't complicated. We get so many gracious letters with, with folks telling us that some word in a song, some line has inspired them. I don't think they have any idea how much they, as our fans, inspire us. But there was this moment, we played a song, Pioneer. We had two shows, back yeah. to back. And we played Pioneer one night at this venue, and it was kind of like an intimate appearance with like 300 folks. They were in the UK. And um, they, they listened to the song for the first time, Pioneer. So the next night we go, it was in London, a bigger, like 1500 seat yeah. venue. And the same group of girls were there. When we played Pioneer, they held up a sign. There's a lyric in it that says, we won't hush. And that was a moment where the three of us, we all saw it and kind of felt the same thing and then talked about it when we got off stage. It was like, that's the lyric that they've taken away from all the new music that has to be the title of the new record. Park your body, 